Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's Damien Guyton here. I'm at Halloween Horror Nights, and I'm here to try some of the foods here at the Texas Chainsaw uh, Food Store. I ordered three dishes. I got the uh, the cherry pie, the vegan platter as well, which is like the grandma's platter, and then also the uh, the lamp spit. So I'm here to try those out and see what they're like, and uh, rate them uh, one to ten. So let's see what they're like. So right here we have the uh, the vegan platter, and then over here we have the uh, the lamb spit, and then up over here is the uh, the cherry pie. So the first thing I'm gonna try is the uh, the lamb spit, and we'll see how that tastes. It's very moist and very seasoned well. Definitely tastes really good. So I definitely, definitely recommend the lamb spit. It tastes really good. There's the hint of barbecue in there. They also give you an additional barbecue sauce with it as well. So uh, we'll see what that barbecue sauce is like with the lamb. Barbecue sauce kind of overpowers the lamb, so I definitely say try it without the barbecue sauce to begin with because it definitely overpowers the lamb. Appears to be like some sausage and then some chicken substitute. So I'm gonna try these vegan sausages and this vegan like chicken substitute. I'm not 100% sure what it is, but let's give it a go. Okay, so now I'm trying the vegan sausage. sausage is definitely it's dry but I've never had vegan food before so I'm not 100% sure if it's supposed to be dry but it's dry but it definitely has a decent taste to it but I still can't tell it's vegan so for all those vegan lovers out there this definitely tastes like sausage Now to try what appears to be chicken. And the chicken substitute definitely lacks flavor in comparison to the vegan sausage. So I know I'd have to probably give this like a vegan sausage on its own. I'd probably give it like a an eight out of ten. But with this like chicken substitute, I'd probably give this a, a six out of ten. But that's me being not being that's me not being a vegan. So you know, perhaps uh, perhaps vegans out there will like this a lot more than I would. definitely say that vegan sausage is really good but this chicken sausage isn't that the greatest so yeah it's definitely it's a five or a six out of ten just because I'm not a vegan so you know but let's go back to the lamb spit and uh, try some more and see if I can change my uh, my rating on this Definitely gonna give this a solid seven. A 
it's just, it, it tastes cooked very well. It's not tough, it's very tender. They did a very good job here with these, so I'm definitely gonna give, I'm definitely gonna give the lamb a, the lamb spit a seven. Seven out of 10, the vegan sausage is a, a five or six out of 10. I'll probably go with a higher at six because the sausage is like really good. Chicken substitute isn't the greatest, so the vegan platter is definitely, yeah, it's definitely a five or a six. So yeah, I'll go with six. And then we have the, we have the leather face, leather face cherry pie. Six out of ten on the vegan platter, and then the lamb spit is it's a solid seven as well. So so far out of my foods options, I'm definitely gonna say the lamb spit and the leather face cherry pie are definitely definitely high up on my list. 